Hello guys, Kaysaya here for another YouTube video. This is going to be my second NFT crypto related tutorial video and the topic is going to be something about how do you actually create an account in Fidan Arena. So I know some of you guys probably already know that ito talaga yung kinababaliwan kong NFT game right now. But yeah, in this video, we're going to be talking about how to add Binance Smart Chain uh, in your MetaMask. And uh, of course, before this video, you should already have a MetaMask account. So make sure you check the tut other tutorial video that I have um, giving you instructions on how to set up or create your MetaMask wallet. So apart from adding the Binance Smart Chain in your MetaMask account, we will also be discussing in here how to add THC and THG contract addresses or those tokens in your metamask wallet and at the same time we're going to be discussing in here how to connect your metamask wallet into your theran arena account and of course getting in the game so yeah um let's start open your metamask account from your browser the next thing you have to do is to add the binance smart chain in your metamask so by default it doesn't actually exist in the list of networks available in metamask so you have to add it manually so you have to go to you have to click that ethereum mainnet up top and then you have to add it um here in the settings in such a way you will be able to add it as an additional network so in here i'm going to be filling out some information in here so network name just name it binance smart chain and then of course the new rpc url just copy that one out chain id 56 currency symbol bnb and of course the block explorer url and then save it and then you're gonna be seeing this one so you have to make sure that the network you have selected is binance smart chain and that you can see the bnb token in here so the next step in here is that you will add the thc and phg in your metamask these are the tokens that is used in in Firan arena so what you have to do is to make sure that you are copying the correct contract address because there's a lot of scams ongoing so there are fake contract addresses so you make sure that you only copy and paste from the official website of feedanarena.com so in here i click the import token and then custom token and then i paste it in here the contract address of the thg to token and just like that it will appear it will autofill the other information and then you go back to the main list of your assets and then up next will be you copy and pasting the thc wallet this time so now easy right so um in just few steps i'm gonna show you guys later on how to do this on mobile so don't you worry so now your account is okay next thing that we have to do is to connect your metamask wallet into in such a way you'll be able to create an account in Thetan Arena wherein you can earn and later on we draw or claim the the money that you've earned from the game the THC or the THG that you've earned from the game so as you can see let me just um um backtrack a little bit so from the website thetanarena.com again you make sure you always double check if you're visiting the the actual website the official website from there you click marketplace or just simply go to marketplace feedanarena.com and then click you click um connect wallet okay let's just show it again connect wallet there you go and then click log in with metamask and then double check if it is the account that you have created a while ago so try to as much as possible familiarize yourselves with the first few characters and last few characters of your wallet. So if it doesn't work, just try to refresh. Feed and Arena just got released and probably they're having some issues with their website website sometimes. And uh, yeah, just try to refresh. Let's uh, try to create a new account again. Make sure that the email that you're going to be using in this account so in case you're going to be planning you are planning to create a lot of other accounts in case you like you wanna 
um, lend your account with NFT heroes to other scholars, then you have to make sure that you make use of different emails each time. So in here, make sure that the email that you're going to use is not yet linked to any other wallets. So here I just made use of a, a unique email. And then of course you check um, after you might get confused in this one. A lot of people actually get confused like, okay, where's the code? Where's the code? So first you have to, of course, input your email in here and then you click the send code via email and then you check your email and then um you know you check your email and then copy and paste the code that was sent to your email into here and then click create account and then you wait for it to load and then that's it click the link button just accept the agreement scroll down until it gets checked and then accept and then you sign in pop-ups appear you just sign in and then wait for the processing to finish if this error happens you just have to like close it and then refresh do the step same steps again so um in here what i did was um I think I clicked the link to existing game account, assuming that I have already successfully created that account. So if in case that error happens, you just have to refresh and try to click the link game account. And then, you know, just try to log in again using the code that was sent to your email. And then, yeah, just try it again. Click link. And then scroll down, accept until it becomes okay. And then this will appear awesome. Wallet blah 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 is now linked to your game account. Login to get started. And yes, that's it. You can now make use of that uh, account uh, into logging in the game. But I know there are some purely mobile users in here so i'm gonna show you in a bit on how to do this steps when in mobile okay now we are in mobile and we're gonna repeat the steps from adding binance smart chain into your metamask mobile app adding thc and thg from there and and also, of course, connecting your MetaMask wallet into Thetan Arena when you are in mobile. So let's just repeat these steps again. So of course, you download the MetaMask mobile application. And then as you can see in, in here, by default, it is the Ethereum main network that is currently in here. So um, in order for you to add Binance Smart Chain, again, if you click Ethereum mainnet, it doesn't display binance smart chain so you have to manually add it up so you go to the burger icon and found on the top left corner of your screen click that and uh, yeah from there yeah from there you can see their settings click that and then click networks and then add network and then from here just you know um paste or type in the same information that we've talked about a while ago so network name is binance smart chain rpc url it is https bsc data seed at binance.org chain id is 56 symbol is bnb and then block explorer url is https colon two forward slashes bsc scan dot and then click add and then you're good to go you already have a binance you already have a metamask wallet that is in the binance smart chain but of course the thc and thg tokens are still missing so you have to click import tokens and uh, of course copy and paste the correct thc and thg G contract addresses and again you have to make sure that you're copying the correct contract addresses because there's a lot of scams happening right now in the crypto and nft world so you have to go to thedanarena.com and uh, you know copy and paste 
both the THC and the uh, and the THG address. So I'm going to show in here. You don't need the other address, by the way, which is the KRC20 because you're using Binance Smart Chain. So you don't need the KRC20 in here, just the B BEP20 THG contract address as well as the BEP20 THC contract address. So you copy that. It's going to be easy. You just have to click that small icon in there and then paste it go back to your metamask wallet and then once you've actually pasted it there in the token address automatically the token symbol as well as the token of precision will be uh, you know will be written so just after that just click the import button and then you'll see your thg token already in your binance smart chain wallet and of course we won't forget thc token as well so just copy and paste the address from the website to your metamask wallet and then that's it scroll down just a little bit to show you thc token symbol as well as the token precision of 18 and then click import and now your wallet is all set so and after this now the next thing you want to know is to how to connect your metamask wallet in Thetan Arena when you are using mobile phone. I know a lot of people are actually having a tough time in this one, but um, you know, it's kind of easy. All you need is actually the MetaMask browser. You don't need any other browser because um, yeah, you'll find this useful. So yeah, from here, you basically click that burger icon from that is found in the top left corner of the screen. And then you can see in here, browser from the list of options or menu. So click that. And then here it'll show you the native browser of MetaMask app. So from there, just type the URL. Of course, you go to feedanarena.com or you can go directly to marketplace that feedanarena dot com wait for it to load and if it so happens that when you when you're trying to click marketplace from the home page of the website and it's not working you can also like directly go to the marketplace link so you can type in marketplace dot feed and and then he always not playing so yeah marketplace feed on arena.com so you head directly to the page where you can actually click the connect wallet button so you just click that one out and then click connect then uh, you know you can create an account this one i already have an existing account so i'm just going to be linking that one in here so but of course if it's your first time to create an account just click of course you have to like click the create a new account from here create a new gaming account so yeah i just have to do the same steps that we did um when you are in a desktop browser type your email and then click send code and then open your email in such a way you'll be able to um copy and paste the code so in this case by the way when i try to like switch windows while using mobile phone apparently um you know this this page got refreshed so if you have a separate phone like maybe you can borrow from your sister or something your sibling so you can just like take a look at your email from on a different phone in case this so happens that it keeps on refreshing whenever you try to change windows so, yeah you type in the code <laughs> you type in the code and then click link account and then who last step click link scroll down accept it's up to you if you want to read it by the way and then sign and then wait for it to process finish its processing and then click log in now then you're good to go click sign again of course if there is a next step so as you can see in here um using the metamask browser my account is already connected into the marketplace and this is what I used to, this is what I use in logging into the game. And of course, once you've done all of those steps, you can now like, um, of course, download Defeat and Arena app. But here's my suggestion. If you want free Feet and Arena coins, THC coins, three THC coins, 
um, as much as possible, try to get a referral link from your friends, you know, or from anyone. Um, because that way, it's not only you are able to get three TCH, but also your friend gets three TCH too. So it's like you're helping each other and that's good. So you try to install the game from the link from your friend. So, you know, it's it's a, it's a win-win situation for both of you. So once you've installed the game, you just have to like, of course, open it. Duh. <laughs> and then enter your email and then of course click send code and then enter your code in such a way you'll be able to log in okay and then of course click log in after that and then wait for it and then your Ta-da! You are good to go. It's like this is your account now. You can only change your name once for free. And I guess in the future, they're going to be implementing ways to change your name. But you have to pay for it. I just don't know like if you have to pay it for uh, uh, in Fiat or in THC or in, in the PowerPoints. We don't know as of yet. Just stay tuned. So yeah, I hope you guys learned something from this video on how to create your Theron Arena account. If you have any more requests with regards to tutorials or guides or anything, just write it down in the comment section below. And then I'm going to work on a very easy to understand tutorial video. Once again, this is Kaysaya, your teacher for this video. And if you want to know more about some updates regarding crypto, NFT, and of course, just basically what I do in gaming and esports and in that metaverse and blockchain world, follow me on my social media. And of course, don't forget to turn the notification bell on. For the meantime, I'm going to say bye-bye. Thank you for listening.